Hey guys. <laughs> and um, if anyone is asking, what is it? Uh, Venti Ice Coffee Sweetened. Heck yeah. There you go. Okay. Uh, we are going to do a monthly favorites video. Yay. Exciting. We're going to go from electronics to cosmetics to hair products to sportswear. Yeah. To books. Wow, books. All in one beautiful video. Wow. <laughs> uh, so let's get started because there's a bunch of stuff and yes. we don't want to bore the crap out of you guys with our normal rambling. Yeah. Okay, so let's start off with, because my hair is actually still wet right now and it's still air drying. Let's start off with some hair products. Yes. Okay, you can start off first because we both use this one. Okay, we're going to start off with the WEN 613 cleanser. Oh, it smells so good. <laughs> we're it, almost out of it actually. Yeah, we are. We're like... Um, a, I can see it just that much less. This is our obviously the cleanser that we use the most of. Yes. So obviously it's our monthly favorite. It smells awesome. It smells like lemon and vanilla and bergamot. Would you say something else? It's very clean and sex. I just like I like seeing it sexy compared to the other like one yeah. cleansers. Yeah, it's my favorite scent um, and it's my favorite cleanser. Yeah, me too. It's, I like this the best. Yeah, it's the most nourishing of all the wind cleansers. Um, you can, really can't go wrong with it. So if you're, you want your hair extra hydration, extra moisture, yeah. the wind cleanser is for you. Yeah. Your next monthly favorite is yeah. this. It's a staple now for me, especially with my new shorter hair because I'm really low maintenance when it comes to my own hair. Yep. I don't really like to fuss with it too much. It's the Orbe Surf Comber Mousse. <laughs> I love this stuff. I basically put this on my hair when it's damp and I just let my hair air dry. It's pretty amazing. I recommend it for those girls who love that whole beachy, tousled look. My hair is stick straight, so totally recommend it for anyone with stick straight hair. If you have more of a wave, like overly curly to ringlets to like like a good size curl definition, you know, I would actually recommend the Wen Nourishing Mousse. That'll work better for you. It won't give that textured look, but since you already have that texture, you don't really need to use this. You need something more the opposite where it'll make it look softer. So I totally recommend that for you girls. This happens to be my monthly favorite for my hair type, so this is my favorite. Yay. The next monthly favorite is going to be an Orbe product, but I actually use it and I like it a whole lot. It's the Orbe Thick Dry Finishing Spray. It's just a really awesome hairspray. Uh, squirts out very dry mm -hmm. so it tends to lock in that shape fairly well because some hairsprays tend to squirt out a little wet so mm -hmm. if like say your hair like for instance Jesse's hair is on the very fine side he lacks density mm -hmm. so when he does try to retain that shape sometimes with some hairsprays it'll drop with this hairspray it basically he squirts it, it out. It locks it in. It locks it in. Yep and just kind of going backwards this is what I would use before it. You'll you'll see a pattern here. It's all Orbe stuff. You know why? Because I steal Anna's products. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I used to actually just kind of like sneak it and then use it and then like uh, put it back really quietly or like I'd run the water while I was using it so she wouldn't hear me using it. Yeah, and then I wonder is... why like I run out so quickly. <laughs> That's okay. This one here is the Orbe Dry Texturizing Spray, yes. which is great because it kind of gives you day two hair on day one. Yep. It gives it just kind of some grit and some grab. And for me, I have really fine hair and my hair just doesn't want to do anything. Mm -hmm. So I have to use something like this just to give it some like... Volume. Yeah, some like stuff, you know? <laughs> it's great. Get this and get this. If you're a guy, these are awesome. Do you use any kind of pomade or anything like that? I, I, I could go through a whole list of all the yeah. crap. But those I are use. your favorite this but one. I could get away with just using these. Oh, nice. Yeah. Very nice. Okay, that's enough Orbe products for yes. this month. No, but it's you. our favorite. Yeah. So. Oh well, yeah. Okay, my next favorite is. Oh, let's start with this. We'll start with these these two right here because I just got it and it all kind of tells a little story. Okay. Okay, so I finally bit the bullet. Is that how you say it? Yeah. And got the Marc Jacobs bronzer. It's so beautiful. I just I know I just barely got this. But I know it's going to be a favorite of mine. It's buildable. It's awesome. It doesn't look orange. Because a lot of bronzers tend to leave that orange um, cast to the skin, and, and which is like my major pet peeve. And it doesn't. When I apply it, I usually apply my NARS. I don't know what this is called, actually. We'll put the link below. <laughs> We'll put the name right here. I remember yeah. I looked it up for Anna just like five minutes ago and I completely forget. Yeah, I love this brush. Jesse's gonna go on his computer right now to go look at it. But basically I'll like put it where like the high point of my cheeks and kind of feather it out. And then next thing you know, I'm using the Mac, Mac, 
Mac. <laughs> <laughs> Marc Jacobs brush. As you can see, I've used it. Whatever. <laughs> it's only for you? Yeah, it's only for me. That's right. It looks I see like too a, much coffee. It looks like a fox's butt. A fox's butt. I don't know. Um, it kind of looks like Mookie's tail. It does a little bit. I'm putting Mookie's tail on my face. Uh, the, but, uh, sorry to interrupt. The NARS brush is called the NARS Ita Kabuki brush number 21. Yeah, this is awesome. Um, mm -hmm. It's great for contouring. Get it. And. That's been a favorite of mine since I since I bought it. Yeah. And then the other brush that I just got right now too is this brush. It's so big and so soft and it's just great. I'm kind of all over as a bronzer. Yeah. I'm not a makeup artist so I can't really explain well, what yeah. I do. I just kind of just do it. If you like it, you like it. Yeah. All right. My next favorite is this. The Tarte Natural Cheek Stain. I love it. This is like a corally peachy pink color. And it's in Blissful. It looks like a giant lip balm. I think you could use this for your, your lips too if you wanted to. I don't use it. I just okay. use it for my cheeks. <laughs> but I have something else on top of it. I don't know what, actually. Multiple layers. I do. I like to layer everything mm -hmm. so it doesn't look harsh. Yeah. My turn? Yes. I'm going to pick a cologne. This is the Dior Fahrenheit 32. Fancy. It smells, let's see, watch it work on the ladies. Smell. It smells so good. So there should be like hearts and moons coming out of Anna's hair right now. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, it smells really good. Uh, I always seem to get a compliment when I wear it. So and guys, if you want girls following you around and telling you nice things, get this. Next. Okay, and the next item that I love this month is this. This is the MAC. Pro Lip Palette in Preferred Pinks. It's kind of awesome and kind of great. For some reason, for this fall, I really like very bold colors, and especially pink. I have this one on right now. Uh, I believe that one is called... I don't know. <laughs> Show Orchid. Show Orchid. Violetta. Uh, no, it's not Violetta. This is, has to be Violetta. Yeah. So it, has, it must be Show Orchid. So yeah. Really cool. You can mix match, create your own colors. I know it comes in two other palettes with two other color stories in nude and I don't know what other color the other ones are. You're just going to have to go look at it on Mac.com. <laughs> okay. I'll put the links down for the other two palettes there. Yeah. But you like it? It's a good... Yeah, it's really cool. Like you're basically for the amount of product that you get for this. Yeah. You know, I think one lip... You get one lipstick is like, I don't even know how much it is because I get a pro discount. Yeah. But I'm sure, you know, I don't know. You like it. I it's like a good it. value. That's the word. Okay, yeah. You're so good. And you get Too to try different coffee. things. Yeah, Yay. it's okay. Sorry. All right. Um, I'll go next. Go. <laughs> As you drink more coffee. My next monthly favorite is these. These are the best shoes ever. You guys have never really seen me wearing them because I only wear them to walk the dogs. But I love these. They're my favorite sneakers. This is my, I want to say my third or fourth pair. It's your fourth pair. Because I, my old, other ones you should see, they're completely worn down. And I have a hole in the back. <laughs> and but I will, it. <laughs> that too. Uh, but I will consistently buy these sneakers. I don't care. I really don't hope they ever stop making them, but there you go, Nike free runs. If you guys are ever looking for a nice walking, you don't have to be using them for running. Uh, sneaker, super comfortable, super light. I couldn't recommend these more if you're looking for a pair of athletic shoes. Yeah, I have a pair and I love them. Yeah, can't go wrong. Mm -mm. And yeah. And then my next item is perfume. Nice. Well, actually cologne. I actually bought this for Jesse. <laughs> and I ended up I think it's it. I think it's unisex. It's unisex. Yeah. It's Tokyo Milk in Dark, right? Yep. No, no in Arsenic. Ah. Number 17. It smells so good. Mm -hmm. I don't even know how to describe the the smell of it. But it smells yummy. The um the notes on the bottle are absinthe, vanilla salt, cut greens and crushed 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 fennel. So you guys can imagine that. It smells pretty darn good. It does. Mm -hmm. My favorite. All right. And my next monthly favorite is going to be the screen that we're using to watch ourselves on. It is the Lilliput. I have no idea the model number. I'll put them one down here. You can grab any of the kinds, I think, on Amazon. 
it is super, super, super helpful if you make videos. Mm -hmm. I love this thing. I can't believe I didn't buy one from the get-go. I'm gonna detach it right now and show it to you guys. I can't say enough about this thing. It makes making videos so much easier. I, like you just, I, to the, the point where I don't even, I can't even think about doing it any other way. And here it is here. Uh, you can see it has a little battery on the back and I have it on a magic arm plate. I'm probably gonna put that magic arm in my next uh, multi-favorites, but I just got it, so it'd be cheating. I just got my Marc Jacobs thing. But I got it in November. Oh, I got mine in yeah. October. I, I think that counts. Yeah. But here's the screen itself. It's got tons of buttons that I have no idea what they do because I just plug it in and it works. And like I said, it has battery on the back or you can use AC power. Best investment if you're gonna make YouTube videos. Mm -hmm. Especially if you are doing like beauty stuff, I yeah. think. Especially for the girls that are going up close, mm -hmm. doing eye makeup or yeah. like whatever yep. you want to call it. Agreed. <laughs> my next favorite item and my last item actually is this charger, this mm -hmm. phone charger. This is my lifesaver. And it's because of I'm always on my phone <laughs> 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 for work, for Instagram, for just being a nerd. Mm -hmm. I'm always on it. And sometimes I kill the battery. So this. I press this button, Yep. Boom, it charges it. Yep, and it's I really picked this cool. up for Anna, well for both of us actually, when we went to Tokyo. Mm -hmm. And I kind of can't believe how useful it is. It is, and it's not heavy or, you know how some um, iPhone chargers are very mm -hmm. uh, bulky? Yeah, because they're the ones that attach on your phone make yeah. your phone really heavy. I hate that. Yeah. See this, once it's charged, just take it off. Just take it off. Yeah, and, and the good thing about it first. is, you, you can charge two. There's two USB ports, mm -hmm. um, so you can actually charge a whole bunch of other things with it. So your iPhone, your iPad, whatever. Um, in Tokyo, we're using it to charge our mobile Wi-Fi yeah. and keep us going. I'll put a link to this one or something similar. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to find this exact one, but I couldn't recommend one of these more, especially if you're traveling. Mm -hmm. um, it really came in handy. Thank you. You're welcome. And the last monthly favorite is going to be a book from me. Here is my... Kindle, old school, I know. Uh, How's it old school? Oh, because they have them in color now. They have now. In color ones now. Yeah. Uh, it's Neil Gaiman's The Ocean at the End Neil of the Diamond. Line. Neil Diamond. <laughs> Neil Gaiman. 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 I can't remember how to pronounce his name, but I'll put the name right here, and then I'll put a cover of the book right here. There. You guys should check it out if you're familiar with the comic book series The Sandman. It's the same author, and uh, I'm like just uh, not a little bit less than halfway into the book, so I like it. Yeah. There you go. Should Are we, we do done? A TV show? A TV show? Yeah. Sure, why not? Let's yeah. throw it in here. Our monthly favorite TV show is... The Waking Dead. The Waking Dead <laughs> again. <laughs> no! I just can't. Oh my god. What is it? Walking, walking dead. dead. Why do I want to say Waking Dead? You just want to wake those zombies <laughs> up. The Walking Dead is our favorite TV show. Yes. Oh my god, yes. Yeah. I actually have another one too. Okay, and? The Carrie Diary. Ah, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Which I I've been it. being forced to watch. Mm -hmm. And you actually like it. You know you do. It's, it's entertaining. The I new suppose. character, the, well, the character for Samantha, the uh, actress that basically took over the new Samantha, mm -hmm. or the baby Samantha, mm -hmm. is so spot on to Kim Cattrall. It's yeah. insane. Yeah, so yeah. you guys should uh, check that out on, yeah. we watched it on Hulu. Yeah. Um, the Walking Dead, um, we buy it on iTunes. So. Yeah. So watch it. Those yeah. are our, our two. Yay. And we did our first monthly favorites. <gasps> oh my God. Yeah. Yay. All right. See you Next later. time I do it, I'm not going to drink any coffee. You're so cracked out. I am. It's too mm -hmm. much coffee.